ECOP has today secured an investment license from Uganda Investment Authority. This follows meeting investment prerequisites, including the contentious environmental impact assessment as the oil and gas sector achieves development mileage as prioritized in this financial year. While speaking to journalists today, Dr. Robert Mukiza, the Director Uganda Investment Authority, committed to supporting the development wherever necessary. We are providing this license to ECOP uh, to show that uh, you know, want to provide the bouquet of services uh, as the government of Uganda to this very important uh, project. Uh, the incentives we bring as Uganda Investment Authority, but also uh, to understand that uh, this is one of the most important investments in this country. According to Deputy Director ECOP, John Bosco Habugumisha, the $40 billion investment will be implemented under the Compliance and National Content Obligations. Furthermore, Ms. Samantha Muhwezi, ECOP's Director of Legal Affairs, confirms Tilenga and ECOP's compliance to environmental impact assessment with a boost in the recent Paris ruling that not only showed inadmissibility but also prerequisite for in-depth analysis to ascertain accusations. Uh, commercialized the pipeline in terms of uh, access to the international market, it's also in regard to refining. So that's how critical uh, the, the ECOP is. We are talking about in the range of $4 billion of investment in the region. There are not very many investments of this size. Furthermore, Ms. Samantha Muhwezi, ECOP's Director of Legal Affairs, confirms Tilenga and ECOP's compliance to environmental impact assessment with a boost in the recent Paris ruling that not only showed inadmissibility but also prerequisite for in-depth analysis to ascertain accusations. continues to be perpetuated by these anti-oil lobbyists because it was a decision by an independent court and it ruled that Total Energy's SC in operating in the Tilenga and ECOP projects has considered within its plans the communities and the and the environment. Despite the resistance and the global demand for sustainable energy utilization, developments in the oil and gas have scored mileage in the development phase, a key priority in this financial year. Samuel Chirimunda, Business Today.